Welcome back to Twin Cities Live at 4. We know this life can get really busy, and when it does, working out is usually one of the first things that we cut out of our schedules. Well, certified personal trainer and weight loss coach Sarah Gerbrot is here with what she calls the perfect five-minute workout routine and how you can fit in a short sweat in your jam-packed schedule. Sarah, it's so nice to have you here. You've got fitness model, who is Twin Cities Live producer Brittany Larson. Yes. Brit dot fit. We love our Brit. Okay, so this is five minutes, and you think really you can get it done. What happens when we cut out working out when we're stressed? We're probably compounding stress. the stress, yes, right? Yes, exactly. Yeah. And five minutes can get your body going, get your endorphins flowing, get your mood going, all of the above. So definitely we want to make that time to get the workout in. Five minutes is all it takes. Okay, that's fantastic. We're going to start with some arm circles. Hit it, yes. girl. What do we like here? Yes, arm circles, working your shoulders, and Britt squeezing her uh, biceps and her triceps as well. So a minute <laughs> of arm circles. I love Britt and her big hoop earrings doing her work. Girl, her little sparkly <laughs> shoes, it's so fun. So what do you want to do in terms of how long do you want to do this and can you really see an impact with no equipment? Yes, absolutely. So we got one minute of arm circles and her arms will get tired if we make her do it for a whole minute. Um, and, and she'll feel it in her shoulders and her biceps and her tries and um, she'll see that definition come through there. But then if we go from the arm circles right to a knee tuck, so she's gonna standing knee tuck. So she's gonna squeeze her core here as she's doing it, pulling her knees up squeezing her um, rib cage to her pelvic bone, and that's how she's gonna feel her core work while getting her heart rate up as well. You know what's nice about these two so far is that these are really simple, and I think sometimes the stress comes from doing a workout that it's like you have to think so much about what to do, and when you're stressed already, who needs that? This is just, it's almost like a moving meditation because exactly. you're just doing it for a minute, you just do it and be done with it. Yes, and move on right to the next thing. Absolutely. Okay, next. Turn oh, to the nice side. Angles. Nice. Thank you. Turn to the side, girl. I like it. <laughs> you got a little stand up, sit down action. Yes. So just sitting her butt down on the chair, standing up just like a squat right into the chair. Um, 10 seconds of that just to keep her heart rate going and then on to the next one as well. Are there any things with this that people want to watch out for if they have maybe knees that are struggling? And what if you're going, okay, Britt can maybe get all the way down to the chair. Can you see an impact from not going all the way Absolutely. down? Absolutely. Go as far down as you can, even if it's only just a, a little ways down to work those those leg muscles. You can see an impact with that as okay, well. Okay, that's really good. Yes. What are you moving on to now, Britt? Britt? She's got a little overhead press? Yes. Okay. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> What's this next one, So Sarah? again, working her shoulders again. Um, she can do it just squeezing her arms, and I want to squeeze as she goes up and down. You can do weights if you want to, so added, you know, get some added benefit there. Yeah. But again, going back into one minute of squeezing um, the overhead press is really, she's going to see that and it's going to make a difference. It is funny when you do something like that for a while. Like, even if you have a, a one pound weight, by the end of it, you're like, man, yes. that one pound is heavy. Yes, Okay, absolutely. we got another one that's a boxer's jab. Let's yep. go there. So this must be like getting a little bit more movement and cardio going. Yep, and she's actually working her, you know, her shoulder, a little bit of her chest and her core again there. So getting a, you know, kind of a full, full upper body workout in that. That's really good. Okay, you have one more? Yes, my Baltistar. favorite. My favorite, Baltasar. This is a really good core workout. And um, it's basically, she's in ball and then star. Ah! Yep. And do a minute of this and you are tired. She makes it look really easy. <laughs> <laughs> She's in pretty good shape. She's pretty consistent about the working out. But each one, just a minute, and yep. then um, and that's it. And do you feel like when you just go, okay, just five minutes, it almost makes you motivated to make better choices throughout the day? Absolutely. Yeah. And if you just do those five minutes, a lot of times you start feeling good, you get your blood pumping, you're like, oh, maybe I could do five more. <laughs> but if you only have time for five, literally, like that five minutes will make a big difference in your day and um, how you feel for the rest of the day as well. Brittany didn't stop moving the whole time. You can feel it. All right. Thank you so much, Sarah. Brittany, great job. For more wellness tips, you can visit Sarah's blog. It's fitnesscoachsarah.net. And we posted that link on our website.